I'd like to start off by saying what an incredible schuss it is to be able to talk about our good friends, the Flugs, and how befitting it is that they're being honored by Book Raton Synagogue since they are such true role models to everyone in our community. <laughs> There are rabbis around the country that would chalish to have the flugs as a couple in their community. Rabbi Flug, you are a real Tamachacham. I never cease to be amazed by the amount that you know, the breadth of Torah knowledge that you have. This is Flug. Your house is always open. And you constantly have guests coming in and out at all times. It's really a zechus for all of us to have you here. We moved here a little over 10 years ago. We heard great things about the Boca Raton community, but we never really experienced it firsthand. And then when we moved here, we saw how warm and caring the community is and how a diverse group of people all get along in a unique kind of way, and that really makes the community special. The BRS community is a warm and nurturing environment for our family. The rabbis have created a community of warmth, chesed, learning, and programming for all ages that our entire family enjoys. All of these things make it an amazing community to raise our children in. One thing that struck us when we moved here is the culture of learning and how the whole community on some level is involved in learning and Talmud Torah. And there are so many different opportunities on so many different levels to learn Torah. And now, 10 years later, we can look back and see how much impact the BRS community has on learning even beyond the circle. People come from all over to hear shiurim, people listen to shiurim online, and it really has a tremendous impact. Rabbi Josh and Penina, we feel so fortunate to count you among our close friends because we learn from your example on a regular basis. Rabbi Flug, you're an outstanding Talmud Chacham. You're a personal role model for me. You've been an incredible resource for rabbis across the country in your position at Yeshiva University, but for me, whenever I need not only your Torah knowledge, but your wisdom, your guidance, and your support. Rabbi Flug, not only is your encyclopedic knowledge of Torah, your wisdom, so impressive, but your humility and your willingness to share that wisdom that makes you such a gift to me, such a gift to our community, and such a gift to the entire Jewish people. Everything that you get involved in, um, your opinion is always valued. You always bring something original to the table, great ideas, and um, a thoughtful approach, a creative approach to everything. Kanina, you and I moved in at about the same time, ten and a half years ago, and right after I met you, I was struck by your kindness and how caring you were. And over the past 10 years, I've come to realize that your kindness and caring are not exclusive to your friends. That is who you are. That's the hallmark of Panina. You are a kind and caring person. Panina, you have all the components of a true Aisha's Chayel. You are the most incredible and loving and devoted mother. You're a great and supportive wife to your husband who's so busy and does so much. Panina, I admire how you do it all and you manage to juggle everything. You do it with a smile and a warm, open heart. You're a family life. You're a devoted mother, making sure that all of your children have whatever they need. And you are truly dedicated to everyone in the community. You ran to the call of action when our singles in the community didn't really have places to go for Shabbos. You realized that that was an issue and you spearheaded an initiative to make sure that everybody had a place the singles, the widowers, the widows, you really cared. You're always willing to devote yourself to our community and we so appreciate it. Panina, I am so proud to be your friend and your neighbor and I so admire all your acts of chesed every day, how you take people in from the community and you lend them a, an ear and you show them kindness and you open up your home and your heart to them.
He's a man that I look up to um, because of uh, the beautiful relationship he has with his Rebetzin, the beautiful Shalom Bayes they have, the fact that there's such a beautiful team together in being Mechanech, their children. Mazel Tov, Yemen Abba, on this special occasion, you're the best. Yemen Abba, you're the best. You do so much for the family and me. I love you, you're the best. Ima and Abba, you do so much for the community. You're the best. I love you. We want to take this opportunity to thank the BRS community for being such an important part of our life over the past 10 years. We love living here and we really enjoy all that the shul has to offer. Our friends are unbelievable. Just looking at Rabbi Flu, you would have no idea that he is as accomplished as he is. And to me, that's the most inspiring part about Rabbi Flu. You've taught me so much personally about what it means to be there for people and to do whatever it takes to make sure that people are taken care of and have what they need. You're someone who I really cherish in my life and I'm so grateful that you live here in Boca and that we've shared this friendship for so many years and I look forward to many, many more years of our close friendship and from learning from your example. Mazel Tov is a truly well-deserved honor. You're humble, you're modest, and we thank you for agreeing to receive this honor so that we have the opportunity to not only celebrate your leadership, but to talk about the example for all of us to follow. Thank you for all that you do, and Mazel Tov on this most well-deserved honor.